fucking generation. Which one? Hypnosis. I think it mostly stays the same, but I could... I don't know, I remember at one time, I think it was 75%. It might have been. And then they nerfed it, and then they're like, we nerfed it too much, we gotta bring it back. Yeah, I know... I know weirdly enough that Disable just, like, changes accuracy all the fucking time. Oh, yeah. Disable's fucking nasty. Yeah, but then there'd be no point to having moves like Dark Void, which is only marginally more powerful than that. Yeah, 60 is... 60 is good enough. Yeah. Even though Dark Void has an extra gimmick in that it hits all opposing Pokemon. It does? Yeah. Hmm. By extension, shouldn't Spore do that too? It should, but it doesn't. Just because of the fact that, you know, you're... Pokemon is just fucking <laughs> everywhere, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Mm, no. Then again, I didn't really play a whole lot of Doom, so the music's not exactly ingrained in me. Yeah, I've never played Doom at all, believe it or not. It's like one of those many games that's classic and famous that it just I've never played for some reason. I played Chex Quest. Ah. Which is a, a Doom clone, so close enough, right? Yeah, so close enough. Machete, I'm gonna need you to not miss. What? What happened? Powder snow, it froze me! Jesus. This is a bad idea, but go harvester. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, wow, that didn't do shit. I think Heal Pulse is going to be one of the first moves to ditch on Harvester. Yeah, for good reason. Huh, since it's technically nighttime now, does that mean my um, appearance table changed? It might have... Yeah, that, that's a gimmick that they had in black and white, right? Well, the thing I is, I have the, um, the thing checked to have time-based changes. Gotcha. And I can confirm that season change is a thing, but, um, we're kind of only at the 11th of the month. Yeah, that's not going to matter worth a shit for... Well, I got the Oko. Kinda wish clear smog worked like haze. Eh, uh, how so? Haze resets all stats. Oh yeah, and clear smog only resets the targets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's a bit of a mixed blessing. 
It's bad because I don't get to reset my speed after hammer arm, but it's good in case for, you know, having set up and then used it. Yeah. Yeah. I was about to say a sludge wave cro <laughs> gets a crit, procs the poison. <laughs> that would be my luck. Yeah. Well, Machete's level 12. Now for Harvester. And thankfully he only needs two levels, so he shouldn't be that bad. Nah. In theory. Ooh, Drizzle's gonna help me. Razor Show. Ah. Uh. Thanks for signing you on Death Warrant, that jackass. <laughs> Or is this song particularly louder than the others? It definitely sounds a lot louder than the others. It's not drowning me out, is it? No. Okay, good. That's all that matters. Cacne is not worth fighting. I'd have to hit it at least three times and only get 25 experience from it. <laughs> so, uh... I believe that falls under fuck that noise territory. I don't have any TMs or HMs yet. Yeah, the way the way the other roads have gone. Actually, you did add some pretty good stuff in the last black run. So. Yeah. Big fucking um, fusion bolt. Yeah. So for the game, I had to fuck you up for the way. No, to be fair, I kind of fucked myself on it because I got rid of it thinking that uh, Gummy could relearn his Ursaring. <coughs> yeah, I remember that. So I just had to give her strength back because pff, decent stab is better than nothing at all. Glad I'm getting all these Raikou. Which, um... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that, um... Fucking... Uh, Perlin appears more at night. Yeah, that... Wouldn't surprise me. It is a cat, so... Also, it's dark type. Also true. So far, I've seen... Oh, I think I've seen the entire moveset from a chop. Bone Club, Earth Power, Tri-Attack, and... Steamroller. Hmm. That's a pretty good moveset. I mean, Earth Power is not great on him, but... Tri-Attack isn't either. Oh, yeah. But at least that... It has a chance to inflict some pretty good status effects, so... True. It's a 20% oh, chance gosh. to do one of three, which actually comes down to yeah. a 6% chance of getting the one you want. Yeah. I'm saving my razor shells for, um, 
Rack up. Good. Yeah, I don't have anything to fucking say either. Uh, Ooh, close combat. Excuse me. All right, so it's not Earth Power. Unless it wounds it at level seven. Close combat is pretty damn good, considering yeah. it's a stab move for fucking much up. Oh, definitely. Also, scary shit. Yeah, but it learns it early, and it learns it as Machop, so... Uh, later Machops aren't going to have it, and WHY IN THE FUCK ARE YOU WHIFFING?! I missed Bind twice in a row. What? Yeah, I've missed three times so far. Ugh. Four times! What is Bind's accuracy? Isn't it like 70, 75, something like that? 85. Oh. It shouldn't be missing four times in a fucking road. Jesus. No, there's four times total this fight. Oh. Missing twice in a row, twi uh, fucking twice. Gotcha. Which is poor shit. Yeah. So I'm gonna stockpile for a couple turns because I'm not using a razor shell. No, it does have earth power. Here. So it must want to close combat at seven. Gotcha. That's what it tells me, at least. I'm going to let this song finish and then I'll turn the game audio back on. Alright. Just for the simple fact that you know, it's only like 10 seconds left in the song, and it's one of the best songs from Final Fantasy 2. Yep. Don't even know much about Final Fantasy 2 offhand, but. It's a good game. It's on my list of RPGs I want to play, so. But I've got a bunch of shit ahead of it, so. Yeah. Like, I want to do all the stuff that I previously did on my channel as a redo, and then I'm going to do some other shit. Cool trainer, Daniel, the male later. And Harvester is a terrible idea for this fight. Yeah, switch him <laughs> Toxic. Ugh. Spatial rend. I've seen a lot of that, haven't we? Ah, it's a proctocrit. <laughs> uh, I don't want to send out machete. Send out bush root. Pusher's probably not much better, but... Thank you. True. Uh, good job using withdraw when you have one HP left there, Shroomish. Good <laughs> job. Great damn there, hamster. Hamstring? Hambone? <laughs> 
fucking love Homestar Runner. It's a shame they've not done anything with it in years. Well, they did do the Halloween thing. A couple of little toss-offs here and there. Um, send Machete to the front. Fuck it. But I'm pretty sure it's like most of been music and stuff. Yeah, the last. Yeah, they had the the rap song one. I don't think I saw that one. The Fish The Fish yeah. I remember the murder mystery thing they did for Halloween last year. I don't think I ever saw that. Watch it. I remember going, holy shit, they're back! And then nothing else happened. Oh, hi! No! Oh, you have got to be fucking kidding me! Psychic. Curlia! Critical hit! Psychic! Fuck! Jesus. He was screwing you over early. <sighs> Thanks, Obama! Machete was short lived. Yep. At least he lived longer than Potato Chip. Back in Emerald. Died yeah. on Route 104. Before I even made it to the first fucking gym. That even feels so old now. What? It was only last summer. Yeah, I know. I love how it was all- I'm gonna put Machete up front! I fucking signed his fucking death certificate with that. Way to make me feel it like shit, almost... game! It was a good idea at the time, I swear. has a fire type mm. and I sent my fucking grass type out oh no oh wow you used gastro acid on my useless ability good job stupid <laughs> good job there scooter I wonder what this totally not semi serious. Sim. Simipore, I mean. Wait. Right. Yeah, semi seer. Panpore. Panseer. Whatever. He wants to learn Aerial Ace. Uh... Shit, I've got really good coverage as it is. And Aerial Ace doesn't really improve it. I mean, yeah, it gives me a little bit wider if I get rid of Spatial Rend, but why would I get rid of a Power 100 for Power yeah. fucking 60? 
when, yeah. in the case of coverage, it'd be doing a right round about the same damage. What? What? Something tells me I should have went with Aerial Ace. Because he just sent out a Cacnea. Which means his Cacnea is probably going to have Aerial Ace. Which means Bushroot is my best bet here. Yeah, I mean, if... If you had, had the chance to switch, which I understand why you don't do that, but... I was gonna say, in that case, then you could probably throw a Harvester out there and... Why would I send Harvester out? A bug type against something that most likely has a flying move. Sturdy. True. And Ian, I also forget if uh, Harvester has anything that would be able to kick its ass. No, I've only got Razor Shell. Oh. Well, shit, that would be pointless then, too. get used camouflage and turned into normal type, which let me fuck it up with Drain Punch. <laughs> the trio badge. Yeah! Yay! Uh... Can't believe I've already lost my fucking starter. <laughs> Can anyone learn that? Because that move is fucking super powerful. Is it like 120 at least? 140. 40, Jesus. Is that... You'd be like, I know it's a stronger version of Future Sight on a shittier attack type, especially in this generation. Um, It's a special move, and Harvester can learn it. So, it, but it's powerful, so Harvester can probably still make use of it. Yeah. It's uh, not as good as Razor Shell with the list, because, you know, slightly higher than half power compared to Doom Desire, and slightly more than double fucking physical attack. TMs are infinite, dude. I can use it whenever I want. And still have it. Gen 5 started infinite TMs. And we were all very glad for it. Mm-hmm. HM1! It's cut. I need cut. That's true. Via GameSync. Yeah, GameSync is defunct now. Let's meet Amanita. So it actually says Amanita's PC. And let's see who can learn cut. Only Machete. Nope. Machete, Bushroot, and Harvester. Let's eh. go into Harvester. Yeah, he still has a Junk slot, right? Yep. Getting her to bind. Gotcha. And technically, Doom's the de Doom Desire is a junk slot too. Yeah, if you can find another physical move that's like roughly the same power as Razor Shell. Well, actually, I'm going to do a, a comparison real quick. See, 75. Oh, yeah. Slightly higher than half power on Razor Shell, with slightly less than half double physical to special attack. So, yeah, they do right about the same amount of damage. Yep. Alright, I'll be back in a second. Okay.
<sighs> Good night, sweet prince machete. You are such a good fighter. But let's go to the dream yard. Still funny. Mona. We found you, Mona. Come on, come on, make some dream mist. Hmm? Huh? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you talking about us? We're Team Plasma. We battle by day, and <clears throat> battle day and night to liberate Pokemon from foolish humans. What are we doing? The Pokemon Muna and Masharna emit a mysterious vapor called Dream Mist, which shows people's dreams. We're gonna use that to make people want to release their Pokemon. We'll show them dreams to, to manipulate in their hearts, just like Peta. Yeah, we're for the animals, but let's kick the shit out of this animal. <laughs> Come on, spit out the dream mist. You're kicking a Pokemon to make it give off its dream mist? That's mean. Why? You're trainers too, right? That's right. We're Pokemon trainers too, but we're fighting for a different reason. Unlike you two, we're fighting for the freedom of Pokemon. And setting Pokemon free means that we win Pokemon battles and take Pokemon by force. So, on that note, we're going to rescue your Pokemon from you. What? Don't hurt Trell. I'm going to kick the fucking ass really bad. Not even going to try. What? <laughs> Nurse Jasmine. Okay. Autotomize, huh? My question is, what would Meryl lop off to make itself smaller? What could it possibly lop off? That's weird. The male grunt was named Jasmine. The female grunt was named Larry. What? Meowth with rock climb, huh? 